Hey everybody, I'm back on place. Civilization 6 Gathering Storm continues with our Germany playthrough. We're at war with... Uh, who are we at war with? We're at war with Cleopatra, Coupe, and Matthias right, right now, and those are going pretty well. Thebes is uh, under attack over here. It's going to fall shortly. With, uh, with Hungary nearby, we have been taking a bit of a beating with some of our troops, but... Uh, Overall, I'm not too concerned with it. Too concerned about it. We've gained an extra diplomatic policy slot over here. Hmm. How are we going to make use of this? There's really nothing great. I guess we'll take... Uh, extra spot. I mean, we could get a minor amount of gold from this. Since we do have some... Envoys still at uh, at places, so I'll take the the slight convenience there, and then we'll move on. All right, battering ram, friend. Good job so far. Let's put you to sleep here while your musketman heals. You guys jump out into the water. We'll figure out where to send you soon. Destroyer? I don't know about this, but I'm gonna do this just to get you some uh, some experience over here. Let's see, if we were to put you here, then it'd benefit him as well, so let's do that. Let us do that. We had some flooding down here, it looks like. Messing up Hong Kong. Oh, our U-boats are ready. Can't forget about the U-boats. So, I don't use submarines too often. If I were to bring a submarine up here and start firing at the walls, would they be able to see me without having a troop right next to it and retaliate? I don't think that they would, but I might be wrong in this situation. It's entirely possible. We're going to try it and see. U-boats uh, are sturdy boys, so... I think it'll... I think it'll at least... Demonstrate something to us. Of value. Right, we got the Thebes wall... Going down. This guy can fight from further away, but we just didn't have a, a spot for him. And I wanted to take Thebes out sooner rather than later. The, the reasoning behind that move and attack there. So this city, I mean, we could take it, or we could let it fall apart over time. I'm tempted to just let it fall apart over time. Because I don't have, I mean, we can obviously shell it from over here. But it's not super significant in any manner. I'd rather just let it flip to Free City and then take it when the Free City can't maintain its own loyalty. More flooding! Flooding in the- oh, this is a bad spot for flooding to happen. We we need a dam over here. Yerevan, can you make a dam? No suitable location for a dam in here. What about you, my friend? Can you make a dam? No suitable location. So this is the problem with where we clustered these things right here. Uh, we left absolutely no spot for an appropriate dam. So we've taken some uh, some beatings out here. Yeah, we gotta reorder those real quick. There you go. So you need to repair these. Let's actually let's clear this first. Put that in front, clear this. There you go. Take care of restoring operations here first, my friend. Who else lost something here? Did Garbage Town? You you lost a bank. We'll get that fixed in a bit. Yerevan. Your Hansa? Dude, your Hansa is highest priority here. Put that in there. 
You can make your neighborhood next, but you gotta get your Hanza fixed. That much I'm certain. So Grenada falls this turn. Here you go. Grenada is ours. And now this might actually fall this turn as well here. We can get a U-boat to hit it. And get you to hit it. And then we might be able to just roll in with this tank. Yeah! Dude, that was that was a successful push right there. If I've ever seen one. Oh, that's rebelling so fast. Yeah, there's definitely no need for us to go deal with them. They're gonna be dealt with by the ravages of time. So we still have this city-state, this city-state, and this city-state in the local area to deal with. Uh, at some point, we're going to have to take a, an accounting here, a proper accounting. I still think that getting... Do we have the ability to do... We did flight. We need to do rocketry. So let's queue up rocketry for next... Because I want to be able to do an Earth satellite at some point soon. Just so we can, you know, take a look around, figure out where everything is. We have, you know, one, two, three, four. Oh, we still have Babylon over here that we need to deal with. So that's five, six with Hong Kong. Seven, eight. I don't know, there's more there's more to be counted here, but you know we're we're well on the way to have conquered we've conquered most of them. We know where a few more are. I'll just have to take a a serious examination perhaps after this video is recorded to see how many of them we know about, how many of them we own, what still remains big questions that must be resolved and answered a doubloon a german doubloon all right where are you going my friend let's uh should we send somebody down here i guess we can deal with this we got to deal with the uh, babylon at some point in the near future I don't know how we're going to do it, but obviously one lone tank is not going to do it. They have an entire army, Hank. That's right, they'll never expect one... One man. It's a suicide mission. Ah, but with a battleship fleet... And a tank. You know, maybe we could whittle away the Babylon defenses from uh, from at range without taking any sort of risks. Now you're now you're thinking. Using the old noodle there. Piecing it together. Alright. We have a mission to do over here. A mission to accomplish the annihilation of one coupe. And his city-states. So this was the experiment we were thinking of. Can they see me? If we get retaliated upon, then yes, they can. Otherwise, uh, you know, it's not likely that they could see you. I've got to bring this thing down. He's at risk. Oh, but look at this. Beautifully done. All right. How about we get you to come take this? Keep the city, my dude. Three turns rebellion? That's not great. That's not great at all. Also, 
Neither of these encampments belonged to Thebes, which was annoying. I was hoping that one of them would get removed from the situation over here. But that is not the case. Oh wait, we need you to get into another location here. So let's move you here. And we need to move... How about we move Magnus up there? Buy ourselves some time here. Where is... So another city is having problems. Oh, it's you. You'll probably actually be fine. We will purchase ourselves a monument up here to buy a little bit of a loyalty. But with Magnus in town, I'm feeling more comfortable. Oh, this is where you're, you had this encampment, that's right. Lots of encampments in the area. So what's our actual rebellion timeline look? Six turns now? We bought ourselves a few turns with that. There will be no peace right now, Cleo. We have to, we have to get some big things done in the next few turns here. You don't even understand. This guy, this guy got in my way. <laughs> yeah, we're we're sure, we're certainly getting stopped by a quadrireme out here. That's how uh, that's how things work, right? He got retaliated against, so they obviously can see him over here. But that's fine. He's still pound for pound delivering some good blows over here. Alright, I would really like to station you in here for a second. Let's put you in here. You know what? And let's have you maybe shell. Nah, don't shell anything right now. Just heal up. So they don't do much here. We can pillage some things. It's pretty unsafe getting units out here. So we kind of have to rely on the ships to do this work. We might want to switch government around to give us even more time over here by... Let's see. View policies. Unlock for 600 gold. I know it's two turns away. But two turns... With a loyalty bonus is going to do a little bit for us switch it over for, from force modernization here just to try to keep thebes under better control that's what we're hoping for right now i'd be interested in getting nukes And if we got nukes, we would need to be able to deliver them. That means like an aerodrome. I'm gonna have Dortmund build an airport for us over here. You should build probably a ship after this. So let's get your factory fixed up and then... You know what, if we merged some U-boats over here, we got a couple, right? got you and you so let's get this going get our u-boats out there get them accomplishing something useful we're getting so much faith per turn and i'm not using it to buy anything right now so i feel like that might be a waste let's go ahead and get uh I think tanks are our biggest win right now. What's our oil situation like? We can still... We can afford to get some more tanks up and running. They buy us a lot of ground power here. Once we get the walls down to something like... Like 50%. That's the threshold, I think, where it starts being reasonable to start attacking the... 
attacking the city directly with uh, some troops. Before that, it's way too strong. Hold on. What are you building here? Spaceport. Alright, where are you gonna go? You have a, a little musketman advance over here? That didn't go too well for you, now did it? I don't know what you were thinking, my friend. Maybe you weren't thinking. So this is a real easy pickup over here. Couple shots. A destroyer rolls in. Easily done. They get some walls built in. You could just buy a monument for them. So you should do that, Alden. Get them uh, a little longer. I think we can take these things fast enough that I'm, I'm not worried about, in this case, the... Uh... The timer there being a problem. Let's see, let's get rid of this unit. So Vilnius. Vilnius, Vilnius, Vilnius. I'll get my U-boat to start shooting your wall here. Ooh, yeah. That's good. That's the stuff right there. Vilnius will be part of the German Empire. Babylon? Is it time? For you to be absorbed. How are we going to go about this? We'd have to... Let's see. We'd have to put our tank up here. And then we could start shelling it with this battleship. So, yeah. That'll work. That'll do, pig. And artillery. You guys are fine now. Let's have you guys move this way. I feel like with all their encampments over here, it's going to be difficult for us to move artillery in against uh, against Egypt. We'll break them with, uh, with the navy. And we'll use these guys to, to move on in here. That's the plan. That's the ticket. And the stuff... Okay. Oh, the U-boat was wrecked. I didn't uh I didn't think it was possible, but apparently he was able to withstand and put up a force to deal with the U-boat. I should have given him a little more respect, and I'm sorry my U-boat friend for that. I'm going to vote for myself. <laughs> Having zero uh, points here sure makes this uh, this thing easier to think about. There you go. This is the vote. Anti-science, pro-industry. And then Hojo got the diplomatic points, apparently, here. Oh! I forgot about the World's Fair. Yay! We got some great people out of this. Ooh. We get two charges from Tesla. At least two. I don't... He might have... I, I assume he only had one to begin with, but... We'll be able to... Do some good stuff there. And we have a general, Mr. MacArthur. Douglas MacArthur is here. 
All right, Paul and Kay, you could use a neighborhood. Let's go ahead and drop it back here. And Muscat, you need a Hansa. Let's go ahead and get you that. You're not fully German until you have a Hansa in the area. We're welcoming you with open arms. And open Hansas. A water park would be something I'd, I'd deem acceptable as an ad out here. Although we could just get you an entertainment place as well here. A place for the fun times. Let's just put it out in the desert. This is where you go to entertain yourself when you're in uh, Augsburg. Is you, you ride out to the desert. Maybe it's like Vegas out there. You don't know. Alright, so which one of these do we want to increase the distance of? Make it better. How about we do Iron Cities? And then we'll probably go toss one on Essence over here. Since I think you have just one more charge here. You know, there, there could be more thought put into that, I'm sure. But I think this will work out just fine. We'll give him more movement so he can come in here and help us out. Dude, Vilnius. You, uh, you really messed with me, hey? You obliterated my friendly U-boat. And for that, you will pay. We get you in here this turn. Yeah, buddy. Keep the city. Of course you keep that city. That's what this thing was all about. Capturing Vilnius. Geneva, I see you. I see you over there. Let's start this operation. How do we do this? We need to get... We need to get you up on this hill. Declare war. Now we can get you on this hill. Do a little bit of a bombardment. And then back you up for safekeeping over here. That's how Babylon is going to fall. Single battleship plus tank. It's good enough. Good enough, my friends. Are you hiding another city state back here? That's definitely not the name of a city-state. That's Wakaira Weru <laughs> I I don't believe that's how it's pronounced. I just kind of started letting my mouth go numb. You know what? The Douglas MacArthur, you probably should move to the other side. I've already moved you here, but we should probably move you to the Egyptian front here. We have a we have more need for a general over here. I feel. Life elsewhere is going pretty well. A general could do us a lot of good out here. Alright, buddy. Let's go help with Memphis. Memphis! How are my boys doing? They're healing. Five turns over here. Let's put you in range. Let's get uh, let's get you guys up in front to defend. We don't want you guys attacking just yet. We'll let the tank do a hit against the walls, and then you know we'll figure it out from there. Are right, you chill here for now? We don't want you getting killed. I don't know what your end goal is going to be, but we have a buddy for you. Actually, you know what we could do is we could buy one more here. Purchase another tank, and then you guys can, can squad up here. Because we got to make use of our faith. 
which we're starting to do here. All right, this push over here with Vilnius in, in control, I would imagine Opongo is uh, is now in slightly better shape than they would make you believe right now. I'll have you guys go. How about you guys go join us over here? We'll have you drop over onto the other side next turn. Just have fun with it, you know? You're spec ops. Make up a cool mission. Give us something important to do. Maybe level up so you can be a more. U oh, somebody got killed, it sounded like. There is no peace for you, Coupe. Who got killed? We already knew that the. Oh, we lost a field cannon. The good thing about compute only the mob and the elite. Ah, ha, ha, fascism. It's time. So we can move this up here. What did we lose from. We lost triangular trade, I think. So let's pick that back up. Although, I don't know what our continent situation is like. Hold on. What is our continent situation like over... Dude, this is all Pangea still. This is all... It's all Pangea. All right, so continents... I, I don't know how this happened, but Pangea... I mean, obviously Pangea was supposed to be like the this, this single... Continent, but... Or the super continent... But it's living up to its name right now and, and making it useless for me to use such things as uh, colonial offices and whatnot. I would have liked to use those, but uh, the game is telling me no. So let's see. Logistics, we like. And then maybe third alternative here. Plus two culture and plus four gold from each research lab, military academy. Coal power plant. And so power plants would get us a bonus here. We could also get ourselves a decent amount more coal, but we're good on coal. I think I'm gonna go with third alternative over here. So loyalty, war wariness, blah, blah, blah. Now martial law accumulate 25% less war wariness than usual cities with a garrison unit gets plus four loyalty per turn. This is uh, this is right up my alley here. Triangular trade is huge for us. It's gonna get you know right now without anything active. We're not getting much money with that active. We'll it we'll at least have uh, like a hundred gold per turn. Dude, I don't know. You know what we could do instead? Here, let's let's change something around here. Where's our Cheaper maintenance. So we'll take cheaper maintenance instead of propaganda. And then we'll take martial law instead of triangular trade. Ah ha ha! There you go. Get it back into a solid state over here. Excellent. Right, we need to... We need to work these walls. I need you to fall. I don't know how we're going to do it. I don't think we're going to be able to do it in time for this to not fall. But maybe this, this thing also may not have recalculated with the other stuff going on. So there is that as a possibility. We'll figure it out shortly. All right, what else do we want from our tree here? Do we want any of these other... Like, collect... Uh, collective... Collectivization. That's what it says. That's a good one. I do like that one. Cold War... Let's get professional sports going here. 
And then... After that... What do we want? Globalization, that trade route one is real good. Do we want to move on to another type down here? Another government type. I don't know. I think we'll head towards near future governments after this. Do you need flood barriers? You don't. Grenada, you should fix your walls. Repair your walls. And then... It's gonna shipyard for you, my friends. That's kind of unnecessary, but we'll do it anyway. And then Heidelberg, where, where are you gonna make your Hansa to really fit into society over here? You want it right here? That's fair. Heidelberg could be a place that builds the, uh... Heidelberg or Tushpa. Or Hag, uh, Hagmatana. They all have snow in the area. So does New Garbage Town. New Garbage Town has no opportunity to do anything of use, though. I'm afraid to say. Sorry, I don't want to wound your, your ego. We only need one additional battleship over here, so I should send the other one to meet up with other friends here. Do you need this? Yeah, let's do that then. No flood barrier necessary for you. Get some trade routes. Flood barrier? Obviously not, you fool. <laughs> uh, what else can we do here? Entertainment. Iron City. Make sure to get you hooked up over here with some entertainment for the area. You do need some uh, some flood barriers, so that's a good get for us. And then, I mean, we need we need war department. I'd like to get that before flood barrier, but I also don't want my cities to flood, so. Priorities. I wanted to move you here. I didn't want to select that unit. And then we're going to have you go to... to Essen over here. Alright, you can hook up with, uh, with this friend. Begin shelling this. And continue... Continue hitting this. Yeah. Memphis, we got you under control. We've got you, friend. Could do a tiny amount of damage, but really I'd rather the artillery do this. I don't know. The tank can help. Get through this thing faster. <laughs> go, man, go. You can do it. So you get line of sight over here on Babylon, you fire. And then you, you go ahead and you back up. We repeat this until the walls fall. And then you'll be good to go. Loyalty is secure over here. Excellent, excellent. Oh, we can actually roll in through Vilnius here. Hold on. I want to get... He requires full movement to do... Did he move? Maybe he moved. I'm gonna send a U-boat through here. So we can get an attack on, on this city from in here. This city below us doesn't even have walls, so let's just get these guys going. A size 19, no walls? Like, what are you thinking, my dude? 
This is why you're losing the game right now. Because you decided to leave these beautiful, beautiful cities undefended. And then suddenly this happens and you're like, whoa, 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 what happened? Man? What could I even do? That guy, that guy Omega's just too strong. The answer is, try harder. All right. And this, their capital has no walls, guys. Their, their capital, it has no walls. What? Just what? This is ridiculous. This is going to be your only city remaining over here. If I feel like uh, leaving it to you. Let's get uh, something to hold the turf over here. Just a field cannon. We'll just put a field cannon in Vilnius here. This is ridiculous. Coupe, man. You should be trying a little harder than this. I gotta be... Totally and completely and ruthlessly... Honest with you, brother. You're not doing yourself any favors over here. I cannot believe this. All right, I want Douglas MacArthur to show up over here. My friend, let's warp you to... to Thebes. Thebes has seven turns. So we do have time to take out Rockadet potentially, but... How's this looking right here? Oh, they, they suddenly, they you know, they improved their loyalty over here somehow. It was looking like it was a five turn thing before, now it's 12 turns. They're trying. They're trying to to ward off the inevitable. But I'm going to let time ravage them. Because that's more entertaining to me than walking my guys back here to kill them. Because that just seems wasteful. This town is unnecessary for our advancement in the game. So we're up on their capital. We're up on Geneva. We're taking out, uh, down here, we're taking out Babylon. We are struggling a little bit in Egypt just because we don't have a huge force over here. And a lot of the cities are hard for our navy to deal with. But we are making progress. Memphis, Rockadet, like this is taking some, some damage over here, some heat. We've got a tank ready to roll in once uh, once the situation is in a, a more amenable state. We'll be good to go. We're, ma we're still making this canal over here, by the way. Osaka's canal. It will never be forgotten. It's, it's so important. It's not very important, probably. I mean, it would be helpful for us to be able to roll the Navy through here. But... The Navy is also 100% necessary over here right now. Makes the thought of moving it across uh, not very compelling, basically. Diplomatic points. Ooh, everybody's tied to two over here. Religion, two of eight. Fair enough. We are getting 321 science per turn, which is more than everybody else right now. 71 from Coupe, 265 from Matthias. Matthias is the one that's kind of keeping with us. So he needs to he needs to be dealt with. Obviously, we're bringing the general over to, here to help. We've got artillery. We have a plan of action against him. But he's not high priority for us right now. This capital is high priority. The Maori stuff, the, the city-states, those are all high priority for us right now. So 321, 172, 181, 51 Hojo, 28 Cyrus, uh, 46 from Philip. 298 culture per turn and 130 tourism. Spain's down here with 22 and 6, 37 and 6 from Cyrus, 54 and 7 from Hojo, 167, 94 from Lautaro. I, yeah, I haven't even seen his territory really, Lautaro's. So we don't know what we're in store for there, but hopefully... Hopefully his anti-Golden Age thing doesn't bite us. I'm nervous about that. 
Matthias is getting 73 culture and 76 tourism per turn. So getting really low culture makes your opportunities a lot worse, I feel like. So these guys that are that are kind of, you know, letting their culture stay pretty low are not getting everything that they could. They're not getting all the utilities uh, to make their, their chances higher. 124 and 100 from Cleo. And 42 and 46 from Coupe. Now, he had a good thing going until uh, he ran into someone who realized that his lack of walls were alarming. And now he's about to be removed from existence. So, yeah, man. This is, uh, look at all his, look at his flood walls over here. Everything over here can flood for him. Also, is this, uh, oh, that's Colossus. I was like... Who owns Statue of Liberty? Does some, maybe nobody owns Statue of Liberty right now. I assume somebody does. I just don't know where it is if it happens to be out here somewhere. But yeah, this is going to be ours soon. Nothing much he can do about it from the looks of it. We're going to take his Broadway. You know, we're going to take his... Uh... Is that all you have here? This special is Broadway. Broadway and Colossus. We're taking them. That's all I know. But that's going to be it for this one, guys. Like the video if you're enjoying it. Subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more. Catch you guys next time. Later.